my name is Karina and I have been tagged in this video the um, sweater weather tag by Shelly from Shelly's Home Life. Thank you Shelly so much for tagging me. I greatly, greatly appreciate it. I absolutely love your channel. If you have not seen Shelly's channel, you need to check it out. It is really good. Um, I will have her channel linked below. I love fall, so this is perfect. This is a perfect tag for me. <laughs> um, okay, this has 15 questions, and then I will tag people to do it at the end of the video, too. So the first question is, favorite candle scent? All right, most of these questions, I have more than one. I don't know if you're only supposed to do one, but I have more than one on different things because I truly love fall. Um, my favorite candle scent for fall is Autumn by Bath and Body Works. Actually, these are all by Bath and Body Works. Leaves, pumpkin pie, and then I have the one burning behind me, sweet cinnamon pumpkin, right there. I love pumpkin and apples. I love the leaves one. They're really good scents for fall. Question number two, coffee, tea, or hot chocolate? I actually like all of it. I love my coffee in the morning, and if I need to pick me up, I'll do that, you know, in the afternoon too. Hot chocolate, I love hot chocolate for um, cooler evenings or cooler afternoons. And then tea, I pretty much drink tea year round. I drink iced tea and then I also drink warm tea. My um, two favorite hot chocolates that I drink, one is candy cane cocoa. You find this at Walmart. It actually has chunks of candy cane in it. This is a good one. And then my other one that I've been stuck on for a while is Ghirardelli. Um, it's just a double chocolate. You make this one with milk. And then the candy cane you can make, you make this with water. Um, but this is delicious. You can get this at Walmart too. Number three, what's the best fall memory you have? The best fall memory that comes to mind is when I was a teenager. I Where we lived um, in Michigan at that time, it was in West Branch. And there's a hill in West Branch that you can drive up this hill and then you overlook the whole entire city of West Branch on these little back roads. Well, my dad found this one back road that went up this hill and when you stopped at this one point, you could see all of like West Branch down below. And in the fall, when the leaves turned colors, it was breathtaking. It was just, it reminded you of one of those magazine pictures or calendar pictures. Absolutely gorgeous. So every year my dad would take us to that point and show us the fall colors up on that hill overlooking West Branch. And I absolutely love that. I look so forward to going, getting in the car and going up there with my mom and my dad and my sister Cassie and me. And we'd all go up there and look at the fall colors. It was breathtaking. It was spectacular. I loved it. Okay, number four. Which makeup trend do you prefer, dark lips or winged liner? I prefer dark lips. I have darker lips on today. Um, I love the Raisinberry by Mary Kay, which I have on today. Really good color. I love the Revlon um, Rum Raisin. And I love the Revlon Spicy Cinnamon. Kind of like brownish reds, I guess, in the fall. That's what I wear on my lips. I love that. Number five, best fragrance for fall. I don't have like a perfume or anything like that that I wear specifically for fall, but I do have soaps that I use, and they're from Bath and Body Works. The one I'm using right now is Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. Love this. I use Autumn Day. And Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. Those are all really good fall scents. So, number six. My favorite Thanksgiving food. 
My favorite Thanksgiving food, I think, would be pumpkin pie. I love pumpkin pie and whipped cream. Yeah. Or I love like when you do the um, homemade <clears throat> homemade rolls and you put Miracle Whip and turkey on a homemade roll. I love that. I actually crave the turkey on a roll. It's so good. So yeah, that and pumpkin pie. Number seven. What's autumn like where you live? Well, we moved out to Texas a couple years ago, going on two years this fall. <laughs> so, and um, lately it's been in the 80s, and actually a couple days ago it was 90. So it's where I live. It's really windy, and it's like summer. It's like summer to us. So we're basically running around in shorts and flip flops still in the fall. We have yet. We had a couple colder days where I had to wear like a light jacket, like a windbreaker, or a light, like a um, hoodie type sweater. But overall, we're basically running around in t-shirts, shorts, and flip-flops for the fall here. So we absolutely love it. It's beautiful weather. Number eight, most worn sweater. Okay, when it gets cooler, <laughs> like probably later November, December area, my most worn sweaters is the real long sweater coats, basically. Mine is a marble one. This is black and white. I found it online. It's a real long, this is a heavier one, and it's a sweater coat. And then I have one that is also a sweater coat, and it is a cream color, and it's a lot lighter. So I usually wear the heavier one in the heavier parts of winter and then the lighter one I'll be wearing in November, December for a jacket, you know, with like boyfriend jeans and stuff. So, and I found this one online too. Both of them are from Forever 21 and I ordered them online, I believe a year ago. So you might still be able to find them online, but I absolutely love the sweater coats. Okay, number nine, must have fall nail polish this year. I have two. I love Essie's Wicked. It's a very deep, almost a black colored red. This is beautiful. I love that. And then Zoya's Storm. This is black with um, like real fine, it's not real glittery, but it has some glitter in it just to break up the full black of it. It's Beautiful. I love both of these. So Wicked by Essie and Storm by Zoya. Number 10. Football games or jumping in a pile of leaves? Football games. Definitely. I love football games. Um, leaves. We really don't have leaves down here in Texas. And um, I remember when we were little and we would jump in a pile of leaves. To me, it's overrated. There's so much dirt in those leaves. Like it was fun to do it as a kid, but then you had dirt in your hair, dirt in your clothes. No thanks, I'll take a football game any day. Either college football on TV or a high, good old high school football game. Love them. Number 11, skinny jeans or leggings? Leggings, I love skinny jeans, but I tend to go towards leggings more and then I put big heavy sweaters over them and um, lays around. Those are my lazy day things sometimes. It's just leggings and a big old shirt. So I love that. Um, but I'm also into boyfriend jeans too. I love boyfriend jeans. Number 12, combat boots or Uggs? I don't, I don't own either. I don't own Uggs and I don't own combat boots. I would love some Uggs but Man, are they pricey. So I kind of got an off-brand something like that. And this is what I got. Is like They're almost like a little slipper boot. They have a little bow right here. They're black. They're kind of furry. They go past your ankle. And I love these. They're like running around in a pair of slippers. I absolutely love these. I wear them a lot in the fall. Especially with my little sweater coats. Number 13. Is pumpkin spice worth the hype? I don't know. I mean, I love pumpkin spice. I love trying things that come out pumpkin spice. I love the drinks at Starbucks, but man, it seems like in the last couple years it has really taken off into like some really crazy pumpkin spice things. 
so um, probably not. It's probably not worth the hype, but it's fun. It's a lot of fun, and you do associate it now with fall, I guess. Number 14, favorite fall TV show? I have a few. <laughs> okay, my first one is Last Man Standing with Tim Allen. Absolutely love that show. Love it. Last Man Standing. Big Bang Theory, love. Lethal Weapon, we just found that one this year, and we are truly enjoying that one. It is so funny. And yet, it's got, you know, mystery, and it's it's good. It's really good. Lethal Weapon, we are truly enjoying it. It has one of the Wayans boys in it, and I love them. I love Wayans, the Wayans kids in movies whenever we see them in. The one is, um, he used to play Major Payne. Wow. And, you know, the other day I was like, he's playing a 50-year-old. I was telling um, Justin, I'm like, he's playing a 50-year-old in Lethal Weapon. I don't get it. Well, Justin looked up his age. He is. He's over 50. I didn't know that. And he doesn't look like it. Oh my goodness. So yeah, definitely. If you haven't checked out Lethal Weapon on television for the um, TV series, try, check it out. It's really good. Blue Bloods, we are loving. We're actually watching it on Netflix. We are coming up, I think, to the ending of the first season on Netflix. And they're like years and years and years ahead of us. But I really like Blue Bloods. That's a really good one. And the last one is Goldberg's. Goldberg's is just hilarious. Truly. If you want something to laugh at, this is a show that's supposed to be, it's set back in the 80s. And if you were brought up in the 80s and you, your childhood was in the 80s, it really has got some stuff where you're like, I forgot about that. Oh, I forgot about that. You know, it is so funny. It is so good. Goldbergs. Okay, number 15. What song really gets you in the fall spirit? Okay, we watch college football in the fall. So for me, it's called In the Big House by Pop Evil. Oh man, that gets us pumped up for a football game. It's called In the Big House by Pop Evil. Check it out. It is a pump up football game for Michigan Wolverines. It's amazing. And my other one is called Let's Go Blue by Michigan uh, Marching Band. And it's, you know, the, I, I love it. And you just, you know, go blue. And you got your hand up there and I'm yelling. And I get into it. I love it. So those actually are the songs that get me in the fall spirit just because I associate, one of the things I associate with fall is college football, um, you know, lots of things. So yeah, I absolutely love doing this tag. This is awesome. Thank you, Shelly, again. I love it. Okay, the people I am tagging, I will um, have the questions down below. So if you want to answer the questions down below, I would love for anybody to answer the questions and I would love to see what is your favorite stuff for Halloween for the sweater um, weather tag. I would love that. So yeah, definitely do that. But the people I am tagging is going to be TD, T from TD. I'll have her channel linked below. Um, Dee Dee, Making It McGee is her channel's name, Making It McGee. Janita, Loving It. Kaya, Now. I Love My Mommy Life. The Kaysen Family. Place Under the Pine. And Kara's Corner. I will have all their channels linked below. And I'm looking forward to seeing their tags as, or their questions answered as well. Thank you for joining me on this fun tag, and I will talk to you soon. Have a wonderful day. Bye.